Good morning, everybody. It's another clear start with those cold temperatures uh, below the freezing mark in a lot of spots. Uh, I'm checking it out. 32 right there in San Jose. We've got middle 30s uh, in Watsonville. Salinas, 34, 27 in King City, and about 25 down in Bradley. Uh, a little colder up in Tahoe now, 12 at the lake, 35 in Palm Springs. Yeah, uh, getting a little ice there in the fountains and uh, across the pool. I don't think so. No swimming weather today. 28 up at the Capitol there in SAC, even Vegas. Uh, looking cold this morning at 29. If you're uh, traveling this afternoon, temperatures will be coming back up, but only to the 40s in Vegas, 30s in Tahoe, upper 50s in Palm Springs. Uh, don't go all the way down to the deserts to warm up. You won't gain anything in terms of temps because it'll be about 58. Uh, right here across the board from Monterey to Salinas. All clear. Uh, nothing to look at right here at home, but you get out into the Pacific. I got a little storm system here. But it's all working northward. This is not headed towards us. In fact, our high pressure ridge is going to stay in control here the next five to six days. Got a light offshore flow. That's an easterly wind. No wind in the afternoon, and then back to offshore in the afternoons into the evening. So a very light uh, wind scenario. That's good. Cold start. Again, plenty of sunshine, though. Back to a lighter jacket maybe this afternoon with upper 50s and middle 50s now. 56 Santa Cruz, 58 Monterey, 59 in Salinas, 57 in Hollister, 59 down in Gonzales, and 56 in San Jose. So a pretty day. Nice one uh, maybe to take a couple of pictures. No low clouds or fog. We'll get back into the 60s actually starting on Sunday. So we have a, a slow, steady warming trend. And by Monday and Tuesday of next week, 62 to 66. That'll be really nice. Overnight lows will still be chilly. First chance of some showers will be next Thursday. That's all it looks like, too. So uh, we did great in the beginning of the season, obviously, in terms of the rain. And uh, now every day we don't get some. Uh, those uh, numbers are starting to fall off. So we'll, we'll continue to wait and see. Got a long ways to go. 20s and 30s by night. And then uh, we'll see mid 30s and mid 40s next week. So not as cold at night, but still certainly uh, pretty chilly.